Chow Chin Chow, Santa and Joe here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Platinum Yes Lock. In the last episode, we made it right. Uh, we uh, went to. We were in Celestic Town. We got our encounter for Celestic Town. We got our encounter for Route 111 West. We went into the Celestic Ruins. We faced Cyrus in the Celestic Ruins. And that's about it for the episode. Today you join me back in Jubilee City because it's time to move onwards. It's time to get to Route 218 and on to Cantalave City. We haven't got our encounter for Route 218 yet. Because the last time we went there, we could only fish. And now we can surf, so we can go to get an encounter if we want to. But I think we might try and wait to the grass on Route 211. You! Give me more... Give me more apps. I've got the memo pad. Okay. Is there any more? I can get the marking map. Okay, that's useful for finding the uh, runaway legendaries. I got the link searcher. That's not useful at all because link trading has been dead for years. Since they turned off the what? Uh, since they turned off the GPS, the GTS. Oh, seven gym badges is the next app. All right, fine. Right. Do I have repels? Before I go into this route, I want to know if I have some repels because I have I have nine repel. I have nine regular repels. They should get me through. They should get me through this route. Because if I can get to the grass, I might get a better encounter than I do on the water. I don't know this per se, but I'm going to bank on the fact that this is going to be the case. We will honestly see if it is. So we're going to we're going to surf across the water. We're going to get we're going to walk around this guy, and there is the grass. We need to have battle with this guy first. Okay, you have a Beniri, I'm fine. Or a spear. You have a Beniri, I'm fine. I don't need to worry about you. I mean, we can also get an encounter in Cantalave. That's also a thing. We can get we can surf in Cantalave. You live? Beniri lip stab. That's the only way you lived. That's the only only way you lived. Is the fact that that wasn't Stab on Lantern. That was an Aura Spear from a level 41 Lantern. You are level 36 Beniri. You are not that bulky. But apparently you are. Right. I don't know what to do in this situation. Because, you know, Eggie would be a Pokemon I would go into. Now you still Blaze Kick with Rockhead. I think I could still Blaze Kick with Rockhead. Yes, I can still blaze kick with Rockhead. You glared me. Don't glare me. I don't like you glaring me. Can I get the... Yes, I can get off the blaze kick. All right, cool. So, I went for a job interview yesterday at a local fixed price store. I'm not going to tell you the name of the store, but, you know, a UK a currency has a... Uh, where there's a shop where everything... Or usually most things cost in the shop the fixed price UK currency of one of those things then uh, and you can probably figure out from that description what the store is there's a police car going past it's annoying it's like I guess you could say it's like your 99 cent stores or your dollar store or your dollar general stores in the US I went for one of the, the UK equivalent of that I went for an interview there, like, yesterday. And I think I did pretty well. It's more of a personality-based interview. They just wanted to get to know me uh, than rather asking me questions about tell me a time when you've done team... when you've done this, that, and that. When you've worked on a team. Tell me about a time when you gave extra, uh, you know, excellent customer service. Believe me, I've had interviews like those before. 
So it was a bit lot better than the interviews that I've had before. So my encounters are hit on the by the way. So it, I think it went rather well. They said they would call me today, today being Saturday, uh, about uh, if I got the job or not. I mean, I don't really know if I... Uh, the thing is, I don't really know if I want the job, you know, because it's working in a... Pa it's working in a, you know, fixed price store. Retail is not my forte. It's not the thing I want to go into. But the fact is, it is a start. I need a start. So I will take it if it's given to... I will... I will discuss it with the people I know and my family and stuff like that and see what they think is the best situation for me. I just like to know already, you know, because, you know, I went to bed last night dreading today. And I'm still with every glancing hour, I am still dreading today because like I, they haven't called me yet. And I don't know if they will call me yet. And it's already one o'clock in the afternoon. So I'm thinking like, you're going to call me. You're not going to call me. Did you mean Monday? Did you forget to yesterday was Friday, and then you, you didn't actually mean to you didn't mean to say tomorrow since tomorrow is Saturday. You know, did that happen? Is that a thing? Because if that is a thing, then I understand. But um, it's still quite annoying. There's still hours left in today. It's just that you know, I'd like to know. Okay, so I can get, uh, so I can raise a leaf you. You've got Giga Drain, don't like that, because that's super effective on me. Please don't do that. Is there any way I can get you into the red? I mean, you live one raise leaf, would you live another? And you Giga Drained again. That's annoying, please stop that. Okay. I mean, I would like a job. If you know me by now, and if you've watched my channel, you know that I'm compute. I like computers. I am a huge computer person. I'm a geek in computers. I want to build. I like building computers. I want. You know, if it wasn't for the being a big, uh, you know, computer chip uh, epidemic right now, because the uh, because the dark times that we don't talk about on this channel, you know. It might be easier to get a hold of computer parts, and I could possibly do what I was planning to do this summer. Which was basically, um, do a live PC build for you guys. You know, we do a live stream and we build, we get all the part. I get all the parts together, and we build my new PC. That was the plan for this year. I was going to spend like, I was going to spend quite a bit on it, but like, of course, you know, pandemics and stuff like that have made me think that this is probably a bad idea. So, we will probably do... There will be... This will happen eventually. It's just that, you know, we need to make it 2022 or 2023 when things are slightly back to normal. Slightly. You know, people are back making computer chips. And it doesn't cost me 500, 600... It cost me 500, 600 pounds for a graphics card when it doesn't cost me like 1500 pounds for a graphics card. Even last gen graphics cards cost me like 1500 quid right now. That's not cool. It's not cool at all. I can't get this thing into the red. Okay, maybe now I can hit him with another razor leaf. Maybe? Because if I get him into red, I... Okay, he's in the red. He's in the red. I've already been mean-looked. You can't mean... You can't mean-look me again. No, no. No, Joe. Don't attack. Throw Great Ball. Come on with me, Hitmonlee. Wow, he didn't even bounce in a Great Ball. He didn't even bounce. He wouldn't... He doesn't even want to come with me. Would you like a poke? Uh, would you like a, a premier ball? Are you a premier Pokemon and you want a premier ball? One, two, Lantern Jam? Nope. Didn't want a premier ball. This is actually getting a bit annoying now.
Get in the ball. I can't hit you. You're, like, unless you... Unless you Giga Drain me, I can't hit you. And I really would prefer you not Giga Draining me because I'm quite low on health right now. There we go. Hit on the annoying. Yeah, I'd like a job in IT if I could have anything, but like... But only to fun, uh, to sort of fund my next idea in life. Which is to, uh, well, I sort of want to help uh, people with this. I sort of want to help people like me. I'm going to call you Jake. I want to help people with my uh, with disabilities like me. I want to inspire them to realize that, you know, they can do things. You know, that be, having, the disability, having a disability is not a, uh, you know, it's not really a... It's a hurdle, but you can get around it. You can become something great. Ow! Would you not coughing? And that's what I want to do. If, that's what I want to do. I know it sounds weird and all that, but I think it would be a very cool idea to do. So that's my plan for this. Sh no, that's my plan for life. But I'm not sure how to go about it yet. I've learned that I have a passion in computers. I've learned I have a passion in entertaining people from doing Power Zone and from doing this. So maybe those are ways to go about it. Hey, Joe, long time no see. Oh, you're looking puzzled. You're wondering who I am? I'm Professor Rowan's assistant and Lucas's father. Professor Rowan asked me to upgrade your Pokédex, you see. So I chose here on a hunch that you'd pass by. Joanne, may I have your Pokédex for a moment? So he's going to basically change... He's going to show us that Pokémon have different forms. And he's telling me just to look out for Team Galactic. Anyway, let's get on with this. This is Canterlave City. There's the move deleter. I would like to use you. Oh, wait. I have a member's key. Fancy another fancy another weird event. Because I do. Although, of course, uh, I'm going to need... I wonder if this would be a dark ride. If it is, I need Ultra Balls. Give me 20. And give me 20 Great Balls as well. Right. What do you have on sale? PP Max, a Moonstone, an Expert Belt, and a Reaper Croft. Okay. Not really anything useful, but like interesting things. Don't get me wrong. Very interesting things. Right. So behind the Pokemon Center, there is this old creepy uh, Harbor Inn. The text is too faded to use. Just read. The tour. Oh, but I have the members key. Right. Members card. A card needed to... I guess I can't do it yet. Okay. Maybe I need a national dex to do that. I hope... I damn sure hope not. You're going to battle me, aren't you? Hey, Joanne. Uh, you're going to challenge the gym. Uh, he's just... The gym is just passed up here. Someone should check if you're ready for this challenge. Someone, that's someone with me with a brand new spanking gym badge. All right, let's do this. You have a full team of six this time. And it might be a fully evolved team too. 
a full-on, fully evolved team of six because everyone is here. And if you're starting with a level 40, and I'm pretty sure that's when I set the... Uh, That's what I set the you know situations to. If a poker, if teams are above level forty, you know, that's a belly drum ninja ask. That's actually quite scary. So imagine if he still had speed boost. He doesn't, but just imagine it. Anyway, yeah, I'm pretty sure I set after level forty for everyone to have. L everyone to have fully evolved mons at this point. Do I go into Jaws and go for the Zen Headbutt? I know I might miss and I'm kind of weak to fighting moves, but I'm pretty sure I'm faster. Jaws? Oh, you good Jaws. Well done. Good Jaws. I didn't kill. No. Okay. Thunder. He missed a thunder. I missed a... Ow. Okay. I scored another Zen headbutt. If I didn't score that, Jaws was dead. Prime Ape. Well, that's back into Toga Kiss. Okay. Not a bad team so far. I almost lost someone. Drill Pack. Almost lost Jaws, but I'm fine. Drill Pack does decent damage, doesn't kill. Light Screen. Okay, that's fine. I can handle a Zen headbutt too. Ish. I probably should heal. But I got the kill on the Primeape, so now I have to switch. Level 42 for Eggy. Nice. Wigglytuff. That's his ace. There's a light screen in play, so I guess I'll go into Daze and Rock Smash it. Yeah, it's probably the play, because I don't really have... I mean, I had Aura Spear on Lantern, but there's a light screen in play, so that's not a good idea. Maybe a Mega Punch. Silk Scarf boosted Mega Punch. How much is that doing? It's not Stab. I mean, it is Stab. It's not super effective, but it's doing rather nice damage. Now, I think it's actually doing so Truth. That is probably better. Blaze Kick, I can handle that. I'm bulky, I'm defensive, I mean, I'm a slacking, for God's sakes. There you go. And a Stantler. Well, now I kind of have to go into Joe. Because the only... You have too many normal types. Too many normal types. The only other thing that can kick this ass is Joe. But there's a light screen in play, so Joe can't kick as much ass as he thinks he can. See? Mud Spore. Okay, that weakens electricity. That's fine. There goes the light screen. Now Joe can kick ass. There we go. So I just kind of need some... Uh, so the reason why I'm recording at this moment in time is that I kind of need something to take my mind off. Oh, come on, another normal type. <laughs> Way too many normal types on this team. I know there's a lot of normal types, but still, it's ridiculous. Yeah, so I need something to take my mind off the fact that, you know, 
I could have a job, I could not have a job. Maybe I want this job, maybe I don't want this job. Maybe there are other, maybe I should take some other opportunities to get what I want in life. I don't know. But, you know, I just need something to take my mind off this whole thing right now. Almost kill. Oh no, I'm fat, aren't I? Oh, okay, I'm not that fat. I'm not that fat. I don't like the fact that I was probably paralyzed, but I'm not that fat. Mega Punch kills! Okay, another grass knot might have killed me. There we go. What just happened? You're telling me I lost? Yes, you lost. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you're just a bit better than me, as usual. But listen up. Uh, let me tell you. How many... Uh, how did you beat the gym badge? Let me tell you that. Because I'm not sure you did with as mount, with the amount of normal types you have. Let me uh, tell you who's going to take on the Pokemon League and become the champion. Yes, you guessed right, that's me. Anyways, I'm, you should train more at Iron Island and toughen up. Yeah, train at Iron Island. That's what I did before going into the gym. Yeah, it didn't work, did it? Because you kicked, I kicked your ass. I'm not sure what I need to get into that members room. I have the members card, but I don't know if how I get into that room. Unless there's something I need to do over this side of the uh, this side of the chamber. There's a, there was a maybe there's like I think there was like a house with nobody in. Hello. Hello, I'm with Jupiter TV. Can I shoot you for a quick interview? Sure. Please select your favourite Pokemon from this list. Uh, please. Okay, so my favourite type is... Fire. Okay. And they're gone. Just like that. Is this the house I need to go in? Hello. I'm going to be a sailor just like my daddy. He's a really, uh, he's a real man. Nothing's, not even the ski scares him. But the gym leader Byron, that's cool too. He's awesome. Our boy has too much energy. That's the best way to be. Yes, that is the best way to be because you have a lot of energy when you're a kid. Right. Uh, maybe I can get an encounter out here for um, Cantilave City. There's a TM, if I remember correctly, back here. TM04, Razor Leaf. I've already had one of those before, but I will take it again. It's not a bad TM. My encounter for Cantilave City is a... It's a polywag. It's Blue Jay on toast. Okay. I mean, it's level 22. Is there any way I could do damage to you? I don't think so. Do you want to just get in the Ultra Ball? One. Two. Three. Just wanted to get in the Ultra Ball. All right, I will take. I'm going to have to call you Blue Jay. After my old friend, Blue, uh, old friend, Blue Jay on toast. I don't know if we're, I don't know if we're friend. <laughs> it's someone I've met and she's very nice. She's a very nice person. I haven't seen her uh, in a while. So I don't know if she still records or streams or anything like that, but you know. She was very cool at the time. You want to set sail? I am now and anchors away. Let's go to Iron Island. Oh, 
All right, so we're at Iron Island. This is Riley's house. He's not here right now, because he's here. Hello. You are? You are Joanne. I am Riley. I am a trainer, yes, but it is a bit odd that I would be training here. Anyways, it's nice to meet you. Here's a gift. It's your Mofor that is strength. That is the hidden machine for strength. Use it outside of battle, you'll need a mind badge from this gym. I'll be training inside. Join me if you like. Alright. I will join you probably next episode, because we've got like four minutes left of this episode, but... I want to get uh, an encounter. My encounter is wheezing. Is there any way I can do so I mean, I can probably do some damage to you. Maybe not that move. Because that move does nothing. Okay, now you know Razor Leaf and it hurts me. Please stop that. Heal. Okay. Can I hit you with another or a spear? Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Okay, didn't die. Okay, I can handle that. I could always hit you with another razor. I can always hit you with a razor leaf now you're in the yellow. Because that shouldn't do as much damage. But you can hit me with razor leaf and it'll do a lot of damage. Because you, you sketched it from me. There we go. Right, that's all the damage I can do to you. Because I think a razor leaf would kill from here. Ultra ball. Go! Get in the ball, wheezing. One. Two. Lantern Joe. Yay! Weezing is mine! Alright, cool. And with about a minute 58 left on the clocks, we have a Weezing. Cool. Uh, gas ball. Gas ball. There you go. Momo look for you, and that's ev that's fine. Everybody is okay. What is this? It's a dread play. Boosting dark type moves. Not useful, but I will take for the moment in time. I could have had a... I, Cyndaquil would have been species. I want to see what this item is before we end off today's episode. Need Arena. Okay, 42 for Joe. Magna Zone. Uh, let's go into... You, and see if we can blaze kick. Eventually we'll be able to blaze kick. Magnazone is uh, truant. There we go. What is this? Hippopotas! I want to see what this item is. 
before we end off the episode, because that's time. I know, I know. That's a drift balloon. And it's an electrolyzer. Finally, we have an electrolyzer. That means we can evolve dancing if we need to. Anyway, we're going to end off today's episode here. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. In the next episode, we will continue our adventures here in Iron Island. And we will get to see Riley again. And I think we'll probably... Uh, uh, deal with Team Galactic down here and we'll maybe even get that egg because Riley is protecting an egg and we want the egg so we should be able to get that too. Ooh, item. Before we end off the episode it's a potion. And on that note we're going to end off the episode. See you next time. Good night. Thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy, then please consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribe. You can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Chair, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me and the rest of the Lantern Nation. You can also check out these two videos in the top right and top left hand corner. And don't forget to check out Power Zone Metal. It's a weekly radio show where you can listen to heavy metal music and so much more. You can find out more information about that at powerzonemetal.uk. But until next time, I am Lantern Joe, and I will see you next time.